Come back to the channel. So first of all, just let me log into the credentials and once you're done with this, just let me come back over here, click on the checkbox and then click on agree and continue. Now just let me wait and just let me activate your cloud shell. It will take a couple of seconds, so just let me wait for that. Now click on continue. Now just simply come back over here, click on the task number one and from here just simply copy this first command, come back over here, wait for a second now. Click on this got it. Now just simply run the first command, wait for a second and then click on authorize. Now again come back over here, scroll down, then copy this command, just simply come back over here and wait for a second and it's done. Now run the second command. Now copy the last command of the task number one, just simply copy like this, come back over here. and run. So we are done with the task number one. Now what we do? Now here just me search for the document AI. Open this thing new tab, come back over here. Wait for a second now and then click on this explore processor. Now just me wait and it's done. Now what we do? Just me scroll down and from the task number two, what we do? Just me copy this name carefully from the point number two. Just me copy like this way, come back over here. Now in the search bar, just me search for the processor name. Just me like this and then click on this create processor. Make sure that it must be invoice processor. Now just me click over here. Now the for the processor name, just me scroll down and from the point number three, just me copy this name carefully and make sure that you do not copy any extra space. Just me copy like this, come back over here paste and then click on this create wait for a second and it's done now if we just simply scroll up let me just okay now if we just simply scroll up and click on the check my progress for the task number one you will get a score without an issue just simply wait and watch now if we just simply scroll down to the task number two and click on this check my progress you will get a score without an issue and if the score is not updated no need to worry because lab take time to update the score if we just simply come back over here and if we just refresh the page let's see we will get a green tick over here for sure just simply wait and watch just simply click over here and scroll down and here you can see we got a green tick and that's the way we have to complete this lab if you still have any doubts please do let me in the comment section thanks for watching and have a good day guys